And what's up, everybody? It's your boy Uchi. Alone. And I am back again. Once again. How y'all doing today? So, I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday season this time of year. If you celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas. If you celebrate anything else, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, whatever it is, Happy Holidays. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I can't really hide my emotions and stuff when it comes, to, or my body language, I guess. I am here by myself. Normally, I'm joined by my brother Ooch, but he's okay. Don't, don't, don't worry. <laughs> he's actually okay. He's over in Florida because as you guys may know, he is a varsity basketball player. And he got flown out to go play in some tournament. So, good looks. Shout out to my brother Uch. Hopefully, he is destroying everybody on the court as he normally does because this man got the moves. But that's besides the point. I just wanted to kind of get the elephant out of the room. Today, we have episode 72. Now, it was pointed out to me via comments underneath 71 after what I said about the animation style being that, oh, it looks like they're going back to like the cheap way, AKA is not looking that great. Well, apparently it's just a different animator, which is essentially what it always was. It's the fact that the, the animation goes from looking a certain way to another way is because of the different styles that they get with animators. And because it looks like that, because of that certain style, that it, that could mean that they are not trying to spend as much on this arc. I don't know. We'll, we can't really tell if this is what the arc will look like in its entirety. But that's literally the last thing I'm worried about. I kind of just want to see where this whole arc goes leading in, into the new arc, the actual canonical arc that begins back in February. So without further ado... Let's check out this episode. All right, let's see what happened. Damn. See, Piccolo can just do anything. What? What the heck? What happened? Who or what was that? That's, that was weird. Yeah, I can definitely tell the difference in animation style already. He fired and he blessed himself. <laughs> what kind of? That's crazy. Wow, so. Did he really die? Yep. Goku is the selfish one in the Japanese version of Dragon Ball. He only became the hero when he be, when he they brought him over here really. Not a lot of people realize that. I mean what do you expect for him to wait around for you to come back? He probably thought he ended the Jap oh. Oh damn. <laughs> so three seconds rule? What is this wrestling? Yeah, different animator. He did he's not bad. It's definitely not bad. It's weird because it slightly reminds me of Dragon Ball Absalon for those that uh are are familiar with that. Yo, how come Goku is so smart when it comes to fighting? That's how you know he's a real warrior. Yo, hit use double team. 
Damn, that's a strong ass double team. Yo, what kind of freaking strike is that? That's like Neji freaking air palm times a hundred. This is crazy. Like, Hit is probably one of the most insane villains Goku has ever fought to this day. Just think about it. Wow. So he can like change the, the, the direction. That's busted! Yo, Hit should be immediately banned in any fighting game he is put into if he got that move. It's not fair. Yo, he's trying to swat him like a fly. What? Oh my god. Yeah, Hit is unlike no other foe Goku has fought ever before. I actually really appreciate this arc, I'm not gonna lie. This this should be canon. I would like it to be. This is a really important fight. Don't tell me this man has a transformation. He don't need one! <laughs> From fear. Come on, Goku, you're supposed to say something clever after that. Maybe so. But I'm gonna still whoop that ass. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Yeah, this is from the preview, so... Okay. Oh, what the hell is Shampoo doing here? Oh, wait a minute. Terrible question. That's Yeah, what he said. <laughs> oh, now nah, he's serious again. What? That is so weird. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, rude. This bull keeps powering up like it's not really helping you out that much, Goku. Wait a minute. Okay, hold up. I, I might have to take that back. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. He, he freaking blew the time skip out of him. Ding. Wow, look at that. Oh, wow. Wow. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Oh gosh. She about to whoop that at. <laughs> oh no. So wait a minute, if this is the hit arc. If I feel like that's it. Like well We about to see what happens in the next episode. Preview time. Alright, let's see what's up. Go. What? 
Oh. My God. Yeah, go on, missing fortune. You're damn right. I can't believe this man, Gohan. You know, people want him to make a comeback. And I'll be lying if I said that I wasn't one of those people. But let me just tell you this. The fact that he is a stunt man for his own hero speaks volumes. I hope that we see this triumphant comeback, whatever that may be, with Gohan. If you guys haven't heard the recent news about Super Saiyajin Ikari, aka the form that Trunks went that everyone was calling false Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Demigod, all that crap. Well, Super Saiyan Ikari actually translates to rage or anger. So whatever floats your boat, Super Saiyan anger, Super Saiyan rage i like rage personally i like saying ikari because you know it's the japanese original i'm about to say that junk everyone's saying since trunks is a half saying gohan's a half saying gohan should be able to unlock that ikari that anger that rage so if he could mix that in with his ultimate form if he remembers how to go into that form i mean it kind of looked like he was in that form on the episode where trunks was leaving it'd be cool if they went in that direction instead of that direction but that's okay we have to understand that this is basically we're in the end of december the next episode is going to come out is basically going to start off, us off in the new year. And then we pretty much have another month and a half to go after that. So a good like six more, six, seven more episodes of these types. So let's not take this too much to heart. Not for anything. These aren't canonical by any means. So with that being said, guys, let me know what you guys thought about episode 72 in the comments below. Let me know what you think about the preview and tell me your thoughts on what you would like to see in the actual arc that's coming in February. Drop it in the comments below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter. Let me know what you guys think. And make sure to check out those links in the description. Make sure you're supporting Dragon Ball Super officially. These links are legit. And they'll get you prizes. I'm serious. They're still, send they're still sending my stuff on the way just so you guys have it as proof. And if I get any more, I'm giving it away to y'all. So make sure you click on those links in the description below. Support Dragon Ball Super the official way. Oh, and you guys don't know, it's about to be on Toonami. We're getting that dub. So, I'll see y'all next time.